From time to time, your robot will need to make decisions based on more than just one set of conditions, such as when performing a given behavior, while the value in timer T1 is less than 2 minutes, and one of the channel 5 buttons on the transmitter has not been pressed. These are the situations where you will need to use logical operators. Conditions can be combined using a logical AND, represented by two ampersands, or a logical OR, two pipes. The logical AND evaluates the overall condition to true only when all of the subconditions evaluate to true. Here, we've implemented radio control of the robot while the value in timer T1 is less than 2 minutes, and one of the channel 5 buttons on the transmitter has not been pressed. Notice that the behavior ceases as soon as the transmitter button is pressed, even though 2 minutes have not elapsed. Conversely, the OR evaluates the overall condition to true if any of the subconditions evaluate to true. To illustrate this, we'll use the same condition as before, but with the OR in place of the AND. The robot continues to be radio controlled after the transmitter button has been pressed. Even a total elapsed time of over 2 minutes doesn't stop the robot from being controlled. In fact, it only stops when both 2 minutes have elapsed and the transmitter button is pushed. As a final note, know that logical operators can only combine two or more complete conditions. For example, checking that a value in a timer is less than 2 minutes and greater than 10 seconds must be written. Time 1, T1, less than 120,000, and time 1, T1, greater than 10,000. Not time 1, T1, less than 120,000, and greater than 10,000. You should now have a basic understanding of how your robot makes decisions based on Boolean logic. Remember that comparison operators enable the robot to derive a true or false value by comparing items and that logical operators allow multiple conditions, each with their own comparison operator, to be combined.